I'm in Morristown, New Jersey. Uh, not Morristown, where the Morristown Mall is. Did you know there's two Morristowns in New Jersey? I'm in the Morristown near, kind of like near Union, New Jersey, New, near uh, uh, New York City. Uh, in 1777-ish, General George Washington was stuck here for a winter of two. And uh, in 1780, we had the worst winter in the history of America. I didn't know any of this. And uh, Washington was stuck in a house here, and he had all these guys build cabins, and they were all starving to death because there was no, uh, no provisions. This is what a uniform would look like if it was nice. Huh? Oh, look at this. Wait a minute. Hey, all right, that's a look. And then you got, this is what the uniforms looked like when they were living here, because they're all ratty and torn. No money was given to the soldiers. Hey, let's see what else they got. That's their calorie assembly. All right. So, we didn't really know this place was here. Didn't know anything about it. But since we were down this street, we figured we'd check it out, right? Uh -huh. So they built this whole village of log cabins. It's kind of like Valley Forge, but, but in New Jersey. Come on. And they have all these exhibits like the cost of war. So if you wanted to get if you, if smallpox, would you get the smallpox vaccine? You, you play the rule. Uh oh. Let's see. How would I do with the smallpox? I'm dead. It just says I did. But the coolest thing in this place, in this whole museum, oh, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. This is the sword that George Washington wore when he was inaugurated president of the United States. This is the sword he wore when he got This, this should be it. And then they have a cannon. Right. Yeah, all that stuff. What? No, I did not return it. You don't want to do the tour? That's shocking. You guys don't want to do that. I do. Oh, you do? Yeah. Wow. Hey, Jules. Do you know what that is? No. Do you know what that is? No. That behind me. King George. There you go. So that house behind me. I guess I should walk on the trail. That house. It's called the Ford Mansion, and that's where George Washington spent the winter. I think it was 1780, 1777, something like that, Seven, in the late 1700s. So that's where I would go. And then the soldiers were about five miles away. Where are they going? Uh-oh. They left me. I'm walking around this house. Okay. And they do tours of this house like every few hours or so. You got to get tickets. And we had tickets, but this is kind of an unplanned stop. So we're just going to do a little look see loo a little walk around the Ford Mansion where George Washington set, set, uh, spent the winter. Oh, look at that. The lady who owned this house gave up the entire house except for two rooms for her family to stay at. And this is like the center of the war, the war. This is like, this was like the Pentagon, I guess. This is where they planned all the war. Uh, you know what, I'll do this. I'll do this and when we go home, we'll see what's in here. Right. I don't think that fluorescent light was part of the uh, original plans. Sam's enjoying his time. All right, so that's it. I don't even know what this is. George Washington sword he wore to the inauguration. Oh, look at this statue. And they have this here. 
Oh, this is my first out of state, out of Philadelphia. Everybody, I'll sing on a song. Oh, those, this historical marker belong. Washington headquarters. Washington made his winter headquarters at the Arnold Tavern, January 6, 1777. Now, a part of All Souls Hospital. December 1799, he established quarters at the Ford Mansion, now maintained as a museum. There it is. Of course that belongs. And there, and we're going to end it here. Me and my boy GW. George. I don't think you had kids. No, you didn't have kids. Or did you have kids? I don't know if you had. Did you have kids? Well, if you did, if you did, happy Father's Day. All right, well, that's it. Uh, a hodgepodge of mess and no order. Probably should have started here and did everything that way, but did it this way. Doodles!